feet on this here ground There's a woman over there Cheers! 35k for the coffee, says the lady. Pizza for breakfast. The smell of fresh uh, L gas in the morning. 175k's to do today. Couldn't be better. We're actually on the same road as yesterday, so it shouldn't be too busy. Today's ride, Puchera to Kimba. We're feeling good. This town kind of looks the same as the last town we were in. I thought it was the last town we were in. Dun, dun, dun. running that hotel told us there was a bang coffee place about 45 k's down the road and it should be open at this time so that solves the problem of grumpy decaffeinated Chris because it's not too hot right now that's where we're gonna refill our bottles and uh, stock up for the rest of the journey because it's about 70 k's to the next stop after that for now just enjoy the morning enjoy the lower temperature and the suspiciously low winds see what happens our oh, boys rocking it you can always hear them coming, can't you? What is it? So I mean, nice. they've, they've done so well. I mean, we're, what, 12 days into the ride they now? They must have been training. <laughs> <laughs> Ultra endurance glass. Give me some strawberries and an apple or two. I haven't seen fruit for a while. I know. What's that? They're really good snakes. Wait, right, snake review for a new segment of the video. Killer pythons, one piece equals one portion. Yeah. Good fruity flavour, but the winning factor is the size of them. <laughs> yeah, the other They're poisonous, those ones. As the man said, 99% of snakes in Australia are poisonous. Before that, an apple. Probably Cra poisonous craving. as well. Is that an Australian apple? It's probably going to kill poisonous. Right, <laughs> Checking out our bikes. <sighs> it's hot today, but at least it's not sunny. Overcast, which is nice actually. It's really it? nice, yeah. Perfect condition. Yeah. Except for the headwind. 36k to the bakery. Mate, you filmed those trees yesterday. You don't need to film them again. Same ones, isn't it? You know what's up. What's up? Top. Vanilla Coke. This is nice here. It's really nice, isn't it? Where are we? Will it, will it, will it sugar? signed on the bakery. Uh, oh, with dinner? Yeah, there. Yeah, shop, man, we shop. can restock. And then what we've got, 100k after this? 100k. Get some more snakes, just check the snake level. A few nuts, a few snakes. I don't know what kind of supermarket this is, but they haven't got sandwiches. So we're gonna do 100Ks with uh, sweets and Nobby's nuts. And a bit of leftover in a bit. Should be all right. Be all right, mate. 100K. 100K, mate. It's like two hours. You and your aero bars, two hours. Tailwind, two hours. <laughs> it could happen, you know. It helps when you put the lid on your <laughs> bottle properly, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright. Yeah. You? Never. So back on the road again, we've been pedalling for about 20 k's. Winds in our favour. Pretty happy about that. Surprising amount of climbing in today's ride. It really is lumpy. Uh, I think we got about 600 metres on paper, which turns out to be a little bit more on our wahoos. They're not the most accurate thing in the world in terms of elevation, so God knows what we're actually doing, but with the weight on the bikes, it's significant. In good spirits though, we've kind of turned off the road that we were on to an even quieter road, which is nice. Just gotta keep rolling in the shade again for now as well, making the most of it. Mate, do you need a Christmas tree for this year? That one. Will that fit on the tail fin? Maybe that one actually. Smaller. Be that maybe can't wait to drink some warm water rehydrate slightly less than i can even behind the big less than uh than 60 k's yeah and we're uh, it's not even oh it's 22 not bad not bad less than 60 k's I'm excited about tonight is he gonna make us an indian yeah, are we gonna get is that like is indian food in australia gonna be terrible or is it are we gonna get food poisoning because we're in the middle of nowhere and it might be weird or is it gonna be all right? I don't know. That's only 
anyway, one way to find out, isn't it? <laughs> what are you doing? I'm getting my Tonys out so I can get some uh, nobbies. Tony. Should probably explain this joke. Got a mate called Tony who looks like a gummy bear. But now he's lost loads of weight, he's all ripped. He's like a ripped gummy bear. Sure, for any. Mate, over knee heart out. Right, last couple of climbs today now. They are starting to drag a little bit. My legs are just tired from the last two and a half weeks. So even a tiny little incline actually makes a significant difference to our speed. But yeah, just one left and then back to the motel, which apparently has a curry restaurant next to it. Sounds pretty inviting, to be honest. Pop a curry. We stopped for a piss here about three hours ago. That's to that side. Yeah. Where's that road go? The moment we've been waiting for the whole trip. Oh Our gracious leader. Oh boy. He's a big one. I don't know, they got that big. He's just really old. We'll call him Derek. He looks like a Derek, doesn't he? Right, Adele? He's not very really talkative today, is he? Poor Derek. Must have been a hard day. Standing. Galarin. Flaming Galar. Hello. Oh. oh. That's a selfie. Proper Galar selfie. Other than the giant Galar, you wouldn't be able to tell if this was a different town to the last six we've been in. I mean, he does help, doesn't he? A lot. Distinguishing individuality. That's what these towns need to do. Maybe that's why they built them. Yeah. Ooh. A lot of Pink Galar merchandise as well, inside. Mugs, snow thingies, toys, magnets. Do they get snow in Australia? They do, actually. I think that was one of the nicest rides we've done. Better than yesterday? Better than yesterday, because it was even quieter. And then we got real, like, we got that massive view across the plain, yeah, and you yeah. can see the mountains kind of on the edge. Wicked. You want to think on how to find a route? It took us across another ball. It was, the only way. it was the only way. It's a gravel road across the Nile if you preferred. Yeah, should we go back and try it? Yeah, we'll do it with a headwind as well. 30 mile an hour one. Yeah, 35, sure. 35 mile an hour. <laughs> we'll ask Lawrence to come as well. Well, then he can sit on the front. Fly. Fly. Boys again. Lovers in the air. Hey, yeah. Beat up, mate. Taking recovery seriously. Anymore. This is alright. Got my peanut butter and jam on toast. Probably have around two of that as well. Got my no sugar coke cola, just for the haters. It's a good day. Oh, look! What are you. <laughs> He's Nick! <laughs> He's getting married tomorrow. He's getting married tomorrow. Look at that beautiful face. Oh, oh, oh he's got he serious. Kind of sad now, doesn't he? We're calling in because we're not going to be at the wedding, so we're calling in. That's what's going on right now. Yeah. I'm sorry, Nick. We're literally on the other side of the world. He's not dressed for a wedding, is he? It's fine. Sam, this is exactly what I'm wearing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, buddy. We'll have a really good day. Bye. Love you. Bye.